doing a problem like this. This says 2 sevenths q equals negative 4. All right? Now, what we're all about is inverse operations. All right? When we're solving one step equation, we're all about inverse operations. All right? What we need to do is we need to get this q by itself. <clears throat> do you, does anybody remember the term reciprocal? What a reciprocal is? Kind of just like, remember, you don't have to know exactly what it is, but you kind of remember hearing about it. One, two people? All right, we got some work to do. So would anybody like to let me know what is, what is the reciprocal of 2 thirds? Anybody want to raise their hand give a shot? Three halves. You're right. So the reciprocal would be 3 halves. All right? All it is is it's inverted. OK, that's the, what the reciprocal is. Now, what happens if we multiply a number by its reciprocal? Let's take a look. All right, so if I multiply a number by a reciprocal, I'm going to be multiplying fractions. That means I multiply 2 times 3, which is 6, over 3 times 2, which is 6. So 6 divided by 6 gives me 1, right? A whole, a 1. And 1 times any, if I say 1 times 5, that is 5. 1 times 10 is 10. 1 times 8 is 1 times x is x, right? So what if I did 1 times q? Would that just be q? By itself? Yes. So what I need to do is I need to get rid of this 2 sevenths. So what I can do is multiply by the reciprocal. So what happens when I multiply this number by its reciprocal? It goes to what? Yeah, it goes over 14 over 14, which is 1. And then 1 times q is q. So therefore, I've eliminated or I've isolated what we call our variable. Now I have q by itself equals negative 4 times 7 halves. So I showed you guys um, in another video how to multiply a whole number times a fraction. But what you, all you need to do to multiply a whole number times a fraction is just make it a fraction. So you can just put it over 1. All right. Now when you multiply fractions, we just multiply across. Negative 4 times 7 equals 28. 1 times 2 is 2. Tw oh, sorry, that's a negative 28. Negative 28 divided by 2 is negative 14. OK? Yes, no, maybe so. Okay. Any questions on that? <clears throat> 